Born in Argentina, relocated to Spain when he was a young man, young lad. And now represents Spain. His choice of Cata Superempe. So although you're a Kumite player, Amy, you still, you know a lot about Kata. You practice Kata, your sister. Stephanie is a Kata player. Yeah. And your and your and your dad, yeah, Terry. A very traditional background. So yes, I very much so. And if you've just joined us and are not familiar with kata, the three key areas of karate is the key on, that's the basics with all the kicks and blocks and some of those we saw you demonstrating in your uh, Guardian Girls project just a while ago. And the kata, which is what we're seeing here, is where you bring those techniques together and put them in a very strict set sequence. And this is all to do with the tradition of passing on the language of karate. Each one of these moves has a meaning, and that can be represented in a bunkai when you're competing for real. But in this case, the kata must be strictly to the conformance of the style or the ruha. You can find kata in other elements of martial arts, judo, for example, Aido. And also in the tea ceremony, there's a kata, there's a specific way of doing things. And it has to be precise. This is all part of the language of karate. How you learn, how you show, demonstrate, and pass on that language, and you are one of the instructors now for the Guardian Girls Global Karate Project. Yes. Totally. That must be really exciting to get involved in something like that. And, and a great honour to be asked to get involved in that, Amy. Such an honour to see the VC part of such an incredible program going forward. Super MP, one of the longest catters in the list, the official list. There are 100 and 102 catters to choose from. But it's fair to say that we only see maybe 20 of them. Yeah, so more than that when you said that. 102. But all the basic catters, all the Hian catters, all the Pinan catters, yes, yeah. they are on the official list of yeah. karate, but you wouldn't necessarily see them in competition at this level. That's not to say that you wouldn't see them at uh, grassroots level. Absolutely. As ever, a very polished performance from Damien Quintero. He's been world silver medalist three times. Each time against the superstar that is uh, Rio Kiuna. Tozaki, Takuji, 